Well, howdy, friends and neighbors. How y'all doing? Shoot, it's a mighty fine day to be out here in the backwoods of Missouri. Hey, welcome back. It's another episode of uh, the MTB Reveal, so we're going to get that going here. Um, hey, just wanted to uh, say sorry it's been so long since I put out my last video, but uh, had a few things going on with Heather, so uh, we're getting ready to take a couple thousand mile road trip uh, going up to Michigan. So we'll have some videos on that coming here uh, in the next coming weeks, um, kind of a day by day, hopefully. So please uh, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, ding, 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 get those notifications every single time I launch a new video. Um, hey, if you'd like to help support the channel, you've got our uh, t-shirt shop, we've got some hats and some shirts and stuff. So uh, for you that have uh, gone over and checked that out, thank you for the uh, support. Those that haven't, get your butts over there and do so. All right, if you want to uh, help us out in a couple other ways, we've got a couple of different GoFundMe pages for uh, Heather's Cancer Fund and also uh, um, her last trip. We've got that going on. So uh, if you want to help out with that, please, I appreciate all the help that uh, we could get on that. Uh, every little bit counts, that's for darn sure. Um, We've got the paypal.me. I'll leave all the links down there in the description. And of course, we're talking about Mystery Tackle Box here today. Um, if you want to get $10, uh, $10 off your first box, make sure you click that link down there in the description. Uh, and hey, sign up and you too can get one of these scrumptious boxes. Um, it's not too late. I know you got uh, Father's Day coming up tomorrow. So um, hey, makes a great gift, all right? Um, mothers, fathers, brothers, aunts, uncles, best friends, whatever. And, you know, it's always a nice thing to get uh, a new box every month and try out some new stuff. So without further ado, let's uh, open this box up and, hey, let's see what we got in here. All right. I love this every month. Mmm, smells like goodness in there. All right. So we've got, uh, of course, you got your dibbles in there. That's going to give you some tips and tricks. There's a few different things in there, kind of learn you a little bit. So uh, those are kind of cool um, when you're sitting there uh, without anything to do. Pick that up and give it a read. We got the old menu card here that's going to tell us a little bit about what we got, kind of the names and the prices, all right? Um, as a uh, MTB member, you do get a little discount off uh, a lot of these products. You know, if there's something you want to add to your box um, every month, they give you an opportunity to add a few things with no additional shipping. So nice way to save a couple of bucks there. So, all right, let's, uh, let's get in here. We've got, all right, first up is the Weston Magic Minnow. All right, where's the Weston Magic Minnow? All right, here she is. All right, the Weston Magic Minnow is, uh, well, she's kind of pretty, I guess. Um, not, uh, well, let's just get her out of here and take a look. All right, got a couple of soft plastics here. Um, it does look like something that once these plastics are tore up, you might be able to replace these with something else. I don't know if you can order more of these plastics in, uh, in a bag of them or how that would work out, but really like the color. Um, kind of a, oh, gray shad looking bottom there with uh, green, black, and uh, gold fleck. Um, get that up there if you can uh, kind of see the different color profiles there. Got a nice little paddle tail. Um, this one comes with a head already rigged into it, all right, with uh, kind of nice painted, uh, looks like a trout to me, um, kind of a trout pattern. But that's got an offset worm hook that's uh, already embedded, and it does uh, swivel on the head, so it's not fixed directly to the head, so that does give that body uh, good movement. So yeah, look forward to uh, getting that in the water and testing her out. Um, that one right there comes in at uh, $9.99 for this one. Um, like I said, uh, I don't know much about getting replacement uh, plastics for that. Um, one thing about plastics, everybody that's ever fished them knows that uh, they don't last forever. Um, so after a few uh, few hits, tip, typically those get uh, tore up. So we'll, uh, we'll have to get up out there and give these a dangle and see how they, uh, how they perform and how they hold up. All right, next on the list. All right, the fat boy. <laughs> Here it is. Look at this bad boy. This is a uh, bright chartreuse, kind of a deep diver. Um, this is sold by uh, Vixen. Comes in at seven ninety nine. dollars um, I tell you, I like one thing right off the bat. Um, a lot of uh, a lot of the baits that you get uh, nowadays are really geared more towards catching the. Uh, 
the the fisherman versus the uh, the fish. <laughs> um, it uh, too shiny. Um, had an old old boy told me, you know, one of the best things uh, he could teach me was, you know, whenever you get a new bait, take and uh, throw it up on the dashboard of your truck there, and just let it get sun faded. Well, this one here is already uh, sun faded for you. So with a matte finish, I kind of like that. Bill's uh, built into it, it's not attached with glue, that's nice. Looks like it's got some decent hardware on it, pretty decent hooks, so um, let's, uh, this is a 3 fourths ounce with a diving depth of 12 foot. Um, depending on the line that you're using, you may get that a little deeper. Um, a little heavier line may uh, hold that up a little bit farther, but uh, yeah, look uh, forward to getting that one in the water and uh, giving her a try. That is the Vixen Fat Boy. All right, let's go ahead and put her back in a in its little cage there. All right, and next up we got the uh, Great Lakes uh, Angler. Um, that would be this one right here. All right, now I really like a lot of these lipless baits. Um, I fish a lot of lipless baits, rattle traps and such, and I've uh, had a lot of luck with those, so I kind of like the fact that they sent this one to me. Um, this one's a uh, perch type bait. Um, got a little purple on the bottom. You've got your perch lines with the green in there. Got a black back. Um, once again, good hardware. It's got a lot of rattle in it. Boy, that's got a lot of rattle. So I'm uh, very happy with that, yeah. Um, does it talk about anything on here we need to... No, just basically a nice little rattle trap with a lot of, uh, a lot of action, I uh, have to assume, just because it's got a lot of ball bearings in it. And it's got two ball bearings right up at the head. Um, I really like that. That's uh, that's more a design feature for casting. Really helps get that uh, that bait farther out there. Um, really assist in the cast. So um, yeah, that's going to be a nice little uh, additive. We're going to have to definitely uh, give that one. And uh, by the way, I'm going to be taking all of my uh, well, the last three um, mystery tackle boxes. I'm going to take them with me up to Michigan. So we've got some rods and reels rigged up that we'll be taking with us. So we'll definitely get a chance to fish these up there. Um, let's see. Oh, we got a little spinner bait in here. All right. Well, this one uh, has uh, the mustad hooks on it, half ounce weight, um, white silver. Um, looks like a nice little uh, spinner bait. Decent size, uh, decent size hook on it. Wire's not too heavy. Um, got two uh, two willow blades on her. She's uh, well. Let's just go ahead and take her out and get a better look at her here. Now I did notice some trailers in there that I think would be perfect on this. Good get that off that staple there we go all right so you got your white skirt with uh, silver head red uh, glass eyes um, half ounce like I said and I'm gonna just dig these out real quick all right um, let's see they come in as the split tail there they are these come in so for two uh, 229 um, that's got one two Looks like five of them in there in cream color. So um, those could be used as a drop shot. Um, those could be used as a trailer for uh, for something like this. So um, pretty active in this uh, post spawn waters. I would say uh, this will be a fun little cranking unit. Um, yeah, all right. I hope y'all are liking what I'm doing. Uh, smash that like button for me. That really helps the uh, promote the channel. Um, what else we got in here? All right, so that's the spinner bait. Now, oh, the bio spawn. I really like these, uh, this stuff here. I think this is a pretty good value here. These come in at uh, $4.99, and this is a seven inch. It's kind of a red, dark purple color. Um, they're calling it red and red and black. It's an eight pack, red shad color. Um, I like the fact that it's an eight pack for uh, for five bucks. Um, that's a good deal. That's a real good deal. A lot of times you don't get a lot of uh, a lot of plastics in there for your money, but yeah. All right. 
Um, nice, I like that. Now, what did they put to go with that? They threw in a couple of uh, number four, yep, number four. Um, must add hooks. Uh, these are a nice offset worm hook, so those will go good with this one right here. Um, so those kind of go together. I really like how MTB puts together packages where you get a little bit of terminal tackle to go along with the plastic baits that they put in the box. Um, and I think last but not least, oh, and these two hooks for two of them, they're looking at a dollar eighty. Um, I already talked about the cream, uh, cream colored trailer tails there all right those came in at do to do to do 229 so not a bad uh, deal there and well last but not least we got the big bite um cottontail worm um kind of a strange little fella um i fished a few of these let's get one out and take a look at it it's got a lot of ribs on it it's just wow oh my goodness that is just ribbed all the way down if you can see that's kind of cool it's got a little blue fleck in it looks uh, dark purple um, doesn't really have much of a scent to it but it's got a nice solid head on it for uh, for hooking into your worm hook so that would also go um, with this so rig this up with uh, maybe a, that would be a good combination a one eighth ounce uh, worm hook and Texas rig that bad boy up and throw her up into the brush. I think that'd be good for cover. So, all right, well, that's our uh, MTB box for the uh, for the month of June. Um, sorry, like I said, it took so long to get this uh, video put together for you, but uh, hey, uh, appreciate it. We're gonna take this stuff up to Michigan with us and do some dangling with it. So uh, there'll be kind of an update to this video. Um, you'll have to stay tuned. Like I said, make sure you ring that bell, ding, 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 to get those notifications every single time I put out a new video. All right, click on those links below. If you wanna help out the channel, I appreciate it. Everybody that already has, thank you so much. Um, those that haven't, hey, every little bit helps. So uh, look forward to this trip coming up. Uh, make sure you uh, hit that like button down below if you liked what we're doing here. I got another box coming up next month. Uh, we've got uh, the whole year's worth of boxes already paid for. So uh, I appreciate that, uh, that donation and that help there. So go ahead and hook yourself up. Get yourself a mystery tackle box. Get one sent out to you every single month. And uh, hey, keep those lines tight dangle on and do yourselves a favor be good to one another peace